Right now, hundreds of thousands of people across metro Atlanta alone are still without power. Good afternoon. I'm Justin Farm. I'm Javita Moore. The storm is out of Georgia, but the cleanup is just beginning. Here is a live look from News Drone 2. You see a large tree in a house in Gwinnett County. And across Gwinnett, DeKalb, and Cobb counties, there are more than 130 roads closed. Schools across the metro area will also close tomorrow, including Clayton, DeKalb, and Henry counties. We're going to scroll the list at the bottom of your screen. We have live severe weather team two coverage of the recovery from Irma, tracking the cleanup with so many families still in the dark. We begin with Channel 2 Sophia Choi in DeKalb County. Sophia, you found dozens of roads closed and so many trees in houses. Oh boy, I sure did see a ton of trees and road closed today. In fact, I found this huge tree down here on Massey Lane. You can see crews are working right now to get it off of this beautiful house. This tree damaged half of it, and it came down right where the homeowner was sitting just moments before. I was sitting right in that room. Uh, working on that desk five minutes before the tree came down. You can see what it looks like right now. Homeowner Carlos Del Rio can't believe he's alive, and you can see why after a huge pine tree crashed into his upper floor office around two Monday afternoon after one big gust of wind. Just a gust, yeah. This tree's back here, we're moving, and we just heard the thunder and this very large pine came down and hit the house. Now this home on Massey Lane in Decatur has several holes and leaks all the way into the basement. Del Rio's son just got married and came here to escape Irma in Miami. We came to be refugees here in Atlanta and only to have this happen. <laughs> now instead of calling it his honeymoon, he calls it Irma Moon. Thankful everyone's okay, they're still joking. Even after this scary event that had tree cutters working hard today and neighbors working to help out. They really were awesome. I, I think that's one of the things that is beautiful about um, Atlanta, that neighborhoods and neighbors are just wonderful. It just, again, it shows you how, how uh, life changes very rapidly, right? I mean, you know, one minute everything is fine and the next minute you're trying to, you're just very lucky that you say, you know, I, I missed a big one, I dodged a big bullet. And that homeowner thinks it's going to take at least six months to fix what this tree damaged in just seconds. Now, already DeKalb County crews have removed more than 27 tons of debris. Half of this county right now is without power, including this neighborhood. The problems that cause coming up on Channel 2 Action News at 6. For now, we're live in DeKalb County. Decatur, Sophia Choi, Channel 2 Action News. So many people feeling their pain. Sophia, thank you. Now